You know who? You know who's really good at rapping? Huh? I mean, a lot of people, a lot of professional people that get paid. Uh, yeah. Dr. Dre. Uh, Spencer. We found out on the bus last night. <laughs> Can we get Spencer up here? Spencer. He's very, he's very concerned about being put on the spot about his rapping, but the truth is, in uh, Spencer, everybody, Spencer Crittenden, the Dungeon Master. With, I don't know if you, you guys are avid podcast listeners. I assume you bought tickets on that too. You may recall that back in Los Angeles, we when we decided to bring uh, 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 that's Raquel. Make sure you tip her. And uh, I don't know everyone's name, but I'm going to be... I thought that would be impressive if I did that. What, what's your name right there? What's, what's your name? Uh, uh, Maria. Maria. Yeah, don't tip her. Don't yeah, tip her. don't. <laughs> she, uh, she, she's working... No, she's working the same tables as Raquel. Raquel doesn't know why she's here. Never met her in her life. She's just following Raquel around. Maria, taking drinks away that Raquel puts down. Maria was fired from this place 15 years ago. Yeah. Maria. Yeah, Maria. <laughs> Some say she died here. Yeah. It's still... From a certain angle, you can still see her uh, ha uh, haunting other waitresses. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there's a photo of Dom Herrera on the wall and Maria's in the background, which is weird because Dom Herrera was famous in the 20s. Shining. So, Dan... Uh, uh, I, wait, wait, what was I talking about? Uh, well, I'll get you back on track. I, 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 I went away for a while. I, didn't, I haven't heard Minneapolis because I, I didn't get a chance to listen to it. And Kansas City hasn't dropped yet, so I haven't heard that one either. So I don't really know what went on. I heard that you had the, you know, the, the, the basic uh, upshot of what the shows were. Spencer filled me in on the D&D uh, campaign. But story structure-wise, there was a thing that you put on Tumblr about the fact that you felt like, as a, if you're the hero of the story, the fact that you haven't changed at all. Right. Did you discuss this in the show? I, I talked about it a little bit. But it was Kansas City, Jeff. Kind of <laughs> right over their heads. So this saying, is the time to talk about it. That nothing gets over the heads in Denver. They're a mile above sea level. <laughs> You, you did this really fascinating uh, little video on Tumblr. It was amazing because you didn't edit it. It was really like you didn't stutter once. It was really like just like it was really good. And uh, second take, I did second take. Oh, was it really? Well, that's nice of you to be honest about that. Uh, <laughs> 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 Sorry. It's the, ooh, the altitude. The altitude. What is happening? Are you like John Hurt and Alien? Are we going to find out that the two? How, how are your two your two days off off planet? Yeah. Uh, it was great, it was great. Let's have some more breakfast. <laughs> so, uh, you're saying story structure-wise, if you're the hero of this, of this tour that you're going on, the fact that you haven't changed probably makes you the villain. Possibly, yeah. Possibly makes Certainly you the Certainly makes me like at least an extra or a, like a horse. <laughs> but, but Spencer released this beautifully written uh, like, uh, blog about like, his uh, awakening or his, like, you know, his, like, he's really just self-examination. He's, he's, yeah, he's 23. On, he's on a journey. He, He's meeting the outside world. He's coming to grips with other people and what that means about him. Spencer learned on this journey that everyone in the world could be into him, but no one would ever understand him. I'm not putting words in it. That, that sounds pretentious, putting words in his mouth like that. But that's, that, that, that's like, he learned. Is, is that about right, Spencer? Is that... I, wouldn't, I wouldn't phrase it that way. No, it sound, it's, <laughs> it, it, that would make you sound like a dick, yeah. yeah. But, but you... You got to a point where it's like people were throwing the equivalent of panties at you. That, that was a, a wool cap. There were dudes throwing wool caps at you. That's as close as this crowd's going to get to throwing panties. Yeah. Like, this crowd is a practical crowd. They, if, they, if they have panties, they're using them. Uh, uh, a, a, a hipster threw his wool cap at you and said, I, I, I don't need this anymore. I, you, you, you take it. And, 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 and then, and then it, 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 even though that seems like a thing, it's like, Oh, I would like that. I would like to be able to push a button and feel what it's like to feel everyone, everyone liking me, everyone appreciating me, everyone accepting me. And you said in your blog entry, to paraphrase you, uh, or to extrapolate what you were saying, that, that the arrival at that goal actually led you to the realization that there will still never be a certain connection between you and other people. Yeah. You could be alone for the rest of your life, Spencer. I, I will be. That's a given. Yeah. So this motherfucker's on a journey. Right. So I'm just a fat so, guy so on a bus. So, so we're going to find out that he's the hero of this, like... And that makes me, yeah. like, Jafar. You, 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 yeah. <laughs> I didn't mean to say it like Christopher Walken, but... It's Jafar. <laughs> that makes me, like, Jafar. Yeah, to his... 
<laughs> Aladdin. <laughs> My story circle is a crystal ball. But now you're doing Jimmy Stewart. Well, I'm also Bane from Batman. <laughs> Many people talk like this. Jeff. Uh, Jimmy Stewart. Garrison Keeler. Bane. So, well, while I was away... Christopher Walken. Uh, you, you, Bill Clinton. Don Knotts. Can we hear... Can we hear... Uh, Popeye. Can, can we hear your Don Knotts? Well, Michael. <laughs> oh, Bill Clinton. I think you should run for president. Oh, thank you. I don't have relations with a woman. Oh, Don Knotts. Oh, Bill Clinton. Bill Clinton. Can wait. I get a little Bill Cosby in there? Oh, you, what are you two talking about over here? I, I got Don Knotts and Bill Clinton talking to me. Uh, well, I'm not talking to you, man. I'm Can talking you? to. I'm talking to Bill Clinton. I'm, I'm not talking to you either. I'm talking to. Can we get the kids go? Uh oh, Gabby Hayes just walked in. Yeah, well, well, Michael. I'm Bill Clinton. I'm Gabby Hayes. I'm Don Knotts. I'm Bill Cosby. No, 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 no. Don't embarrass yourselves. It, it was not full applause. There's there's there giant pockets of no no Good. no applause. Good. And those people are heroes. Yes. There's people like, no, no, swing, swing and a miss. There will be times when I will appreciate effort from you uh, when I will need it. Uh, uh, but uh, there are also times when I need to be punished.